Hey boys and girls, how is it going? So it is season six, finally, of Cold War Warzone, or whatever you want to call it. So let's take a look at the gameplay trailer they've got lined up and see what they've got in store for us. Got reports of multiple explosions in Verdansk. Oh God, what have I done? Shake it off. We're going to finish what you started. Woo. Old gulag, lots of changes in downtown. Deprogram. Red doors in the multiplayer, interesting. Kind of be like portals, like split gate. That's interesting. Dig it. Burger Town, stuff like that in America. With Boko? Interesting looking map. Sledgehammer, so showing off the battle axe. It's an odd choice. Ooh. Not a zombie fan, but. Map design looks interesting. Yeah, I, I, I can get behind that. Nah, dude. Cerberus is fine. Nice. Madness. Adler, we have unfinished business. Yeah, Stitch don't look pleased, man. I mean, it looks great, right? Like, it looks good. They do a good job with their marketing, for dang sure. So as far as the event coming up, this is what we're looking at here. Um, weekend exclusive, we've got Iron Trials coming up. Um, we've got Payload hitting a few times we've got rebirth coming back in some weird ways um plunder sticking around here and there but leaving man i know a lot of you guys love plunder um but it looks like we're losing plunder on the week of october 14th and it's coming back gosh all the way into the 28th interesting 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 so look at the battle pass in the last video the ooh, Art Deco Grav is really sweet. I kind of like that nice and clean. The Haunting, October 18th. We'll get some information on that. So the Scopes and Scatter Guns. So this is Scopes and Shotties, um, Snipers and Shotties from basically what we played before. Basically what happens is we get Snipers and, and Shotguns spawned on the map. Um, so it'd be kind of, kind of curious to see how this is going to end up as we spawn with a Marshal, which is just... A problem child of a handgun. So we'll see how that goes. As far as map changes go, the fissures are heading and the bunkers. If you want to make sure you see those, be sure to, to uh, follow the channel because we're going to do that live and looking at that stuff. The old gulag is back. I'm sure with the way that I play, we'll see the gulag as well. Loot across Verdansk has changed. So the 410 and the grav have been added. New gulag loadouts, new ground supply route boxes. Plunder respawn behavior has been updated to provide players with more dynamic infiltration, so more looking more spawn points for plunder, which is a big, big change for plunder players. And the RCXD kill streaks have been removed because it is bugged, it's broken, it just doesn't work. It's not good. Lots of uh, changes and bug fixes. Feel free to pause if you want to read through these. Big UI change that I want to talk about is they're adding this right here. So as you're picking up a Tech 9, this will tell you whether it's burst, single shot, or full automatic. This is absolutely huge for those of us that are frustrated with that Tech 9. So keep that in mind. So kill feed timing is something very, very interesting. Verify whips. 10 out of 10. I am a fan. Whips over Tim. Um, gives you an idea on all of that stuff. So as far as weapons go, we're getting the 410 and the Grav at launch and the Battle Axe. The Lapa and the Hammer and Sickle will come later. Um, we will, of course, be covering the EM2 and the Tech 9 unlocks. The only major changes are a bunch of recoil increases for these guns, which we kind of expected as they are currently kind of just too strong for the recoil levels. As far as attachment changes goes, we're looking at the Tiger Team Spotlight. They are decreasing the movement speed multiplier as well as the ADS movement speed multiplier, um, also getting a decrease. The OTS-9 is essentially getting a nerf. The ADS speed multiplier has been decreased. 
So maybe actually it's, it's getting kind of a buff. Um, the reload time has been decreased from 2.6 to 2.7. I don't think they understand that, what that means. Reload empty time decreased from 3 to 3. Point, so it's going to be an increase there. The VDV um, getting some changes as well. New operators, we're getting Mason right away. Fuse is coming later. Kingsley, if you pre-ordered, um, Kingsley is there. The Prestige icons look freaking awesome. I'm a fan. We're going to hit 300 like we always do. The Berserker bundle, the Fuse bundle, the Zombie Zapper bundle, the Joker bundle. Um, pretty big update. Pretty sizable. going to be, man, 40 and a half gigs. Lots of stuff coming, guys. Um, like I said, be sure to hit that subscribe button. We have got lots of stuff coming for you over the next little while. So, I'll see you guys around. Have a good one.